Welcome back to Empowerment Nursing. I'm Linda and I'm a nurse educator. You are tuning into our weekly application of In the Know, where we make it simple. Today we are applying our video um, on using one concept to apply to electrolytes. That could have a massive amount of knowledge from just understanding one concept. Uh, go back and catch our video from last week where we discussed calcium and magnesium levels. And if you recall, low calcium and low magnesium cause hyperreflexia. Um, we know this because high calcium and high magnesium sedate. So here's our question for this week. The client is being evaluated for low calcium levels. So think hyperreflexia. Clinical manifestations of low calcium include which of the following? Select all that apply. So with a select all that apply question, we're gonna treat this as if it's a true or false. We're gonna go through each one of these options and see if it's true or false. If it's true, we're gonna circle that as part of the answer. So here are the options. A, tetany. Does tetany make sense with low calcium levels? Is that true or false? That is true. We're gonna circle that because it relates to spasms in the muscles, tetany, right? And low calcium can cause hyperreflexia. So we're going to circle that as true. B, negative trousseau sign. What is negative trousseau sign? When you put a blood pressure on your arm, your hand is going to spasm. That sounds very much like hyperreflexia. This is saying though, B, a negative trousseau sign. Is that true or false? That is false. So we are not gonna circle that because the true answer would be positive. So negative true so sign is not included in this answer. C, positive cho cho sex sign. Is that true or false? So what is that? When you touch the cheek, twitching occurs in the facial muscles. Well, that sounds a lot like hyperreflexia, doesn't it? So we are gonna select that as true and we're gonna circle that. D, skeletal fractures. Is that true or false? Low calcium, is that gonna cause skeletal fractures? Indeed it is. So we are going to circle that as true. And E, hypotension, is that related to low calcium, or low calcium levels? No, it is not. So we are not gonna circle that, that is false. So the correct answer to this question regarding low calcium levels and what would be the clinical manifestation would be A, tetany, C, the positive show sex sign, and D, skeletal fractures. For the answer to this question and more, and for all concepts simplified for your registration exam, check out our complete study package. We guarantee you will pass or your money back. See you next time on In the Know.